And also remember, if you are either buying a property or selling a property, always, always have an inspection, not just for the peace of mind and also to get the deal closed on time. What is going on family? This is RJ Bautista, your favorite incredible realtor with LPT Realty here in Central Florida specializing in new construction. Today in this video, I will tell you step by step and also what you need to do when you are purchasing a property. Not about just chasing if you are planning to sell a property as well because this is important and this is crucial. But before I start this video, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. The most important thing, you know that, smash that like button for me and share this video to all all your family and friends especially for those people who's planning to buy or sell a property anytime soon and last thing that i would like to say here i am filipino nagtatagalog po ako kung may mga question po kayo text nyo po ako wag nyo po ako tawagan kasi may rami akong nare-receive na spam call so kung tatawag po kayo or kung mag-text po kayo sa akin alam ko na seryoso pa yun. so without further ado let's jump into it so basically what i'm gonna talk about here is if you are planning to buy or sell a property especially here in central florida is the inspection okay inspection is very 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 important even though if you are selling a property or if you are buying a property why because inspection is the most important part in the process of purchasing a property or selling a property why because in inspection the inspector who will inspect the property they know how to process and for those things they know what you need to do as a seller or a buyer if you are going to purchase a property or if you're going to sell a property they need to see the actual property if this property is okay to sell or it's okay to live even though it's a new construction or it's a resale house okay however what i did earlier today the one that i just get under contract a week ago or two weeks ago we did a full inspection like earlier today with my preferred inspector brian mccormick which is from pillar to post so what i did was i went to the inspection today earlier like around 11 o'clock and then i asked him some question just for you to make aware what you need to do or what you need to take note if you are planning to sell a property or buy a property either new construction or resale house okay this is most important before getting the property closed or before you close the deal okay so here is the video that i just took so i hope you like this video and also shout out to richmond american builder to my clients to let me video their property we just get under contract and as you can see this property that we just take some video or inspection today is a two-story home 2500 square footage four bedroom three bathroom and two car garage and this is a richmond or this is the american richmond builder property we just built and just got under contract and also i'm super excited to my clients to close this deal after this inspection what brian did they will or he will send the report to my clients and then he will also send the report to the inspection of the or superintendent of the builder okay this is what happened once you get under contract you need to have a private inspection private inspection is a optional for you if you want to use like brian which i will show you later on and then after that we will conduct a first walkthrough and then after first walkthrough the final walkthrough and then after the final walkthrough the closing of your property in new construction you can do this as well in resale house and also before selling a property if you're planning to sell your property i highly recommend to get your property inspected before putting your property in the market okay so i will show you what we discussed and also what question that i asked from brian earlier i hope you like this one okay so check this out what is going on family this is RJ Bautista, your favorite incredible realtor here in Central Florida. Today in this video, I will talk about on one of my preferred inspection, which is Brian from Pillar to Post. And then currently we are doing some inspection or we just did the inspection here for my client, which is new construction. And also Brian will give us like some little inspection that we need to know before buying property and also for selling property so that if you are in defense of buying or selling your property, you will understand how important the inspection is. So Brian, would you like to introduce yourself and also how long you've been in the industry for being inspector and also, you know, 
all about your company. So my name is Brian McCormick. I own a Pillow to Post franchise with my son, Jimmy. Uh, we've been in business for almost six years now. And uh, yeah, so I think, you know, when you're selling a house, the biggest things you have to look at is, am I up to the current safety standards? Because that's going to come up in any inspection. It's going to come up as a, as a high priority item um, because it's a safety issue. So there's things that uh, like GFCIs, and without getting too technical, but things that need to be in place that were required 20 years ago that are now. Uh, the other things you have to look at are um, ages of some of the equipment that makes it tough to get insurance. If like if your water heater's too old, uh, that causes issues. So as long as you're aware of those ahead of time as a seller, it gives you an opportunity to get quotes, replace them if you want to, do repairs if you want to, but at least have an idea what you're up with. As far as a buyer goes, kind of the same thing. You're looking for all the safety features. You know, maybe this wasn't required in 1995 when this house was built, but it's required now. Um, and the reason it's required now is because we've gotten smarter. We've learned from mistakes and we've changed. So Florida building code changes all the time. Uh, not that we're code enforcers, but there's reasons for it. And so you want to make sure that when you buy a house, at least the safety features are where they need to be. And you know that, you know, if you got kids or whatever are living with you, uh, the house is safe. Uh, there are electrical things you look at, AC things you look at, obviously roof, age of the roof is another thing you got to look at for insurance. So all those little things will add up to, uh, you know, things you got to be careful of when you're buying a house because some of them are bigger ticket items. Absolutely. So hear that. And also last question for you, Brian, before we, we go for this one, some people were thinking like, they're going to buy a new construction like this property. They don't need to do like a private inspector like Brian does. However, I always recommend to my client that always do a private inspector. It's just because of your peace of mind. And for that reason, what would you suggest or tell to the viewers that if they do inspection, private inspection, either a new construction, a brand new house? Well, look, I still think there's things we find like in this particular house, you know, found three plugs that don't work at all. Uh, the AC is not turning on. I'm sweating right now because the AC is not working. And I'm sure those are probably easy fixes, but you can move in and then find out as you're trying to move in that the AC doesn't work or you can know it ahead of time. I also think it helps you if you come up with a list of things before you close. I think the builders are more apt to do it before you move in. Then once you moved in and you call something out, they'll get to you, but you're on a list. So getting it done before you move in can help you expedite the repairs and get them done. Yeah, absolutely. Because you don't want to have a problem as soon as you come here and then you feel like after two days something broke or, you know, because you didn't do a private inspection. So private inspection is always a good hand for you if either if you are buying new construction and also very recommend if you're buying a resale house as well because resale house you don't know what side there so for the last one brian what would you give some advice or tips for those people who's planning to buy property in the future and also sell the property in the future you know for inspector wise i just think it's the same thing i think you know you, you can't take it personal especially if you're a seller i know you've lived there for a long time some of the work you've done yourself it's not personal and i understand that maybe when you did something it was allowed it's just not allowed anymore and those are things that can kill a sale because you're not going to be able to get insurance until it's fixed you know and, and some things the insurance companies might give you 30 days electrical things they give you three days sometimes three days is not a lot of time to get things fixed so getting it getting the inspection done for all the, the safety features are by far the biggest items that can affect you in the age of equipment that can affect you from being able to close because you have to have insurance to close and you can't have insurance until these things yep absolutely so for the last one brian uh would you like to tell about where they can find you um and also you know feel free to tell your telephone number so people or viewers who would like to use you uh, as an inspector and also where which area here in Central Florida do you service? I go everywhere from Daytona to Haines City, uh, Winter Haven. Uh, we do Titusville. Uh, you know, if it's within an hour, hour and 15 minutes, we'll be there. Uh, you can find us at pillowtopost.com slash Brian McCormick. You can do uh, Pillow to Post the McCormick team. That's us. Uh, my phone number is 407-417-2874. Okay. And also, uh, what kind of service do you do apart from just basic inspection so they will know, you know, what the option? So we, we have home inspections that we do. And then we also do uh, wind mitigations. We do four points. We do uh, roof inspections. We do mold, termite, uh, just about anything you need to go along with a home inspection. People want to add those on. Okay. So here you go, guys. You hear that. So if you need information, what I will do is I will put Brian's information down here in the comment box. And also I will keep his telephone number, um, email address, and also his website so you can see or else, you know, if you don't have any information, you come to me. I will give you all his information and also I will connect you with Brian, which I always do to my clients. So if you have any question regarding about this video, feel free to reach out to me 
or to Brian. And once again, thank you for watching this video. And also remember, if you are either buying a property or selling a property, always, always have an inspection, not just for the peace of mind and also to get the deal close on time. So thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I'm out for today. Peace. What is going on family? This is Arjo Bautista, your favorite incredible realtor with LPT Realty here in Central Florida, specializing in new construction. Oh. Let's try that. Let's again.